Today we're talking about flattering jeans to hide a large tummy and look slimmer instantly. I have three pair of jeans that are flattering and help to hide a big tummy. If you want to look slimmer instantly wearing jeans, you will want to hear all about my new favorite denim jeans. So I have three different jeans at three different price points. So hopefully there's something here for everybody, something that you can find that will work for you. A little bit about me, I am petite, I'm five foot four, and petite actually refers to our height. So it's usually five foot four, some stores five foot three and under are considered petite. I have a 27 inch inseam. So I have a short inseam, but a longer torso and I have an apple sized belly, which means I carry most of my weight in my belly area. So I never really enjoyed wearing jeans in the past because I never looked at high rise jeans before and I don't know why I didn't. I would always go with like mid rise and it's just not a good look on me because it cuts me right in the middle of my problem area. So then when I would sit down, they would get tight and you know, you get the roll over the top and I just, I didn't like jeans. But ladies, these three pair of jeans, I've been wearing them. I really wanted to wear them a lot so I could give you my honest opinion. And that's what I'm sharing with you today is my honest opinion about all three. So when I'm looking for jeans now, I only look for high-waisted jeans and that a high-waisted jean is anything that has a nine inch rise. And the rise is the measurement from the crotch seam to the top of the, uh, the top of the pants. What do you call that? Um, oh gosh, not the hem. You know what I mean. And I have found nine inch works best for me because it goes over my belly button. It covers up a little higher. So it really cinches in my problem area. And whenever I sit down, I don't have my jeans falling down. They're not tight and I don't have any rolls hanging over the, the waistband. And that's what I was trying to think of. All the jeans I'm showing you are slim straight leg. I don't like typical boot cut pants on me because they just don't look good but what I have found is if I can get like a slim boot cut or a slim straight leg those are the shape of the bottom of the pant that work best for me. A regular boot cut might work for you if you have a longer inseam but it's something that you're going to have to try and figure out for yourself but I'm just sharing what has worked for me. I just find that if I go with a wider boot cut, it just looks sloppy on me. And as you can see from the photo I'm showing you, you can see the difference between wearing a wide leg pant on me and then a slim straight leg pant on me. But if you can pull off a straight leg or a boot cut, they are really the best for creating the illusion of a longer leg. And I still like skinny jeans, even though I know some people say, not in style, but who cares? Wear what you want. If I find a pair of skinny leg jeans, I'm going to wear them because I know on me they do look good, especially if I'm putting them in to a booty for the winter. So the first pair of jeans that I want to introduce to you are the least expensive and they are by Old Navy and they retail for 35 US, 40 Canadian. They are their high-waisted wow slim straight leg jean. I ordered a size 22, but I feel like I probably should have sized down to a 20. They do feel a bit loose and I think the more that I wear them, you know, in between washes, that they do get a little more stretchy, but not, you know, enough that they're going to fall off or anything. But I think next time, if I would order them, I would go to, to the size 20. They're available in regular, tall, and petite lengths. And this is what I think Old Navy does so good anymore because they are very size inclusive. They carry like the small sizes from a double zero up to, I think a four X, maybe bigger, I'm not sure. But the thing is they also offer regular, tall, and petite inseams. They are one of the few stores that I am aware of that carries petite length pants, and that's great for us petite ladies. So you might wanna keep that in mind whenever you're looking for pants. And another thing is, it doesn't matter what size you are with Old Navy, everybody pays the same price. Cause I know a lot of stores, one that I've been shopping from recently, uh, I won't mention their name, but I think you know which one, they do um, charge more for the plus size, which I get, you know, it's more material, whatever. 
So in these jeans, I'm wearing a regular size with a short inseam. And that was the other thing I wanted to bring to your attention. They offer different inseam lengths. I bought this pair of pants right off the rack, did not have to shorten them, which is a blessing for me because I usually have to shorten everything. So I really appreciate what Old Navy is doing with their clothing. So overall, the jeans are comfortable. They move with my body as my body moves. The denim though does feel thinner than the next two pair of jeans that I'm going to show you that are at a higher price point. But by no means am I dissing these jeans. If you're looking for budget jeans, I think these are great. Or if you don't wanna spend a lot of money on jeans, like if you don't wear jeans a lot, I think these would be a great pair to start with. The next pair of jeans that I have for you are by NYDJ. They are the Maryland straight leg jean. They retail for 99 US and 129 Canadian. And I'm gonna tell you right now, they're often on sale at Nordstrom. I picked mine up on sale. They carry size double zero up to plus sizes. They also carry petite length in the NYDJ line. I bought a size 20 regular, but I had to have at least six inches hemmed off of the bottom of the legs. They were just way too long for me. They are so soft, so stretchy, so comfortable. They create a streamlined silhouette. They are so, so flattering. Whenever I wear them, I feel like I'm wearing butter. They're just, oh, they're luxurious. These jeans have a lift tuck technology to help flatten the tummy and lift the butt. Okay, they're not gonna make me look any thinner. Like you can only do so much, right? But they do, make my problem area look smooth and not bumpy or frumpy. You know what I mean, ladies. They are available in several different washes or shades. Overall, I really enjoy these jeans. I can tell that the denim is high quality. I totally can feel the difference between this denim and the one from Old Navy. Again, these jeans move with my body and they are not constricting. They hold their shape all day long and they still feel great after many hours of wearing them. I love these jeans. They are totally worth the money and these are going to last forever because the quality is so great. The stitching is wonderful. The, the rinse of the jean is wonderful. They're just like a second skin. They're really, really great jeans. If you're enjoying my video, make sure that you subscribe. The next pair of jeans that I have for you are Wit and Wisdom, the Absolution straight leg jean, and I got these in a plus size. They're $78 US. They were currently on sale when I'm filming this video, but I don't know if they're still on sale. 102 Canadian. I am wearing the size 20W in regular length. I didn't have to shorten them. Awesome. They are available in regular and petite lengths, although I couldn't get my size in the petite length. I will try to link these exact jeans, but if I cannot find them, because every time I've looked, they've been out of stock, I will uh, link some different ones that you might like. They are a stretch denim that you can tell they are very, very high quality. They have panels built in them to mold and hold the belly in. They're very comfortable, they're not constricting, and Wit and Wisdom offers regular petite and plus sizing. Overall, I do love these jeans. They're so comfortable, they move with my body, they don't lose their shape after wearing them for hours on end, and they're so comfortable, I do wear them all day now. I finally found some jeans that, you know, I'm comfortable wearing them all day. Before I used to put them on, go run my hair, and then take them off when I get home. I think they're totally worth the investment because they're going to last for years. Now, if I had to rank these three pair in order of preference, I would say that the NYDJ and the Wit and Wisdom jeans are tied equally for first place. They're both very, very similar in fit and comfort level. Um, the one thing about the Wit and Wisdom is that I didn't have to get them shortened. The only pair I didn't have to get shortened was the MYDJ pair. That would not stop me from buying a pair if you have to shorten them. They're really, really lovely. The Old Navy, I think, is a great budget-friendly pair of jeans, but the quality isn't as good. I'm just being honest, it isn't, and obviously that's reflected in the price point. But if you're looking for a budget pair of jeans, go with the Old Navy. I don't think you'll be disappointed. 
I feel that the Old Navy jeans, the denim isn't as thick and the stitching isn't as finessed as the other two. So let me know what you thought about my jeans video. I've got lots more fashion videos coming up. I'm going to link my 21 fall clothing hacks to look slimmer instantly video here on the screen. If you haven't watched it, go check it out and I'll see you very soon. Bye.